Okay, today I'm going to introduce you all to a computer program named GIMP. GIMP is a freeware program which you can download from their website, GIMP.org. It's an imaging editing software program. It's a great program. We can just check out their website here about GIMP. We have found our way to GIMP.org. We'll click the download link, and which will take you to a page where you have several download options. Uh, download GIMP via BitTorrent, download the GIMP directly, or download GIMP on Microsoft Store. You can choose which one of those you like best. We can do a lot of interesting image editing. For example, let's open a picture. I'm going to click to my desktop. Whichever folder you use is up to you. And I'm going to open to this picture of this American Red Squirrel. Okay, now we'll click this text tool here in the pane on the left. And we'll enter the text. Sir Boring dot top. Okay, we can see that the black text is selected and the text font face is Earl. But let's just change that to Comic Sans. Okay, now we can see it's Comic Sans and the text is black. But let's change the text color. We'll click this square here, change color of selected text, you can see. And we have several options. We can choose GIMP, CMYK, watercolor, wheel, or palette. I'm going to choose palette. Whichever one you choose is 100% up to you. And I'm going to change the text color to red, this reddish color here. Okay, that's great. But another awesome thing you can do with the program is change each letter individually. You, see, you can see I've selected this one letter. You can see the golden square, or I think it's more of a golden rectangle around it. And now let's click this color again. The color square up here. Excuse me, I'll show you that again. We, click, we can click this, change color, select a text. I'll change that to this bluish color. And we can go through them one by one, just like this. This is pretty awesome. Okay, sorry that took so long, but there you go. You can see that you can change the colors of the, the letters individually. Uh, I think it's an awesome program. As I said earlier, you can download it from, for free from GIMP.org. I think it's an awesome program.